Today I'm with Cameron Reeves from Vici Vision, part of the Car Fulham Group. We've got an innovative new product here, a bit of an exclusive really. Cameron, tell us about what we have here uh, from Vici Vision. So what we've got here is a shadow graph replacement on the shop floor, bringing innovative technology to a standard process. What we've got is a quick, easy measurement solution to a lot of shop floor problems in that you don't want to send a part to a quality department yet, but you still want to have control over the products you produce. Okay, we're going to see a demonstration yep. very shortly. Um, it, from my perspective, historically these used to be quite common, but they kind of died out over, over recent years, haven't you? But this, this is yep. bringing this technology back with a few, few changes and a few enhancements. So a lot of the problems with field of view measurement machines is that you can't get the stability and accuracy required for a shop floor measurement. Typically for a quality department they aim for a very neat, very quick process, whereas on a shop floor measurement they found that you had to rerun parts and the lighting in particular affected the measurement of the parts. Okay, let's do a demonstration with the part that you've got on here. So if you talk us through uh, yeah, how, how you would operate this. Okay, so as an operator you typically jump onto the machine and so you put your part on the machine as we've got it here. Select the lighting you want so you see, right, I can see my part, I'm happy the way it looks. So we can tick that. So what we do next is, it operates a very similar way to any kind of touch screen technology. We can just draw along the edge here with our gestures and produce measurements. So we take an intersection at that corner and do exactly the same on this side. Take two intersections and now we're going to select these two nodes to produce a distance. So that's a, it's a very quick example of what the machine can do. It's meant to be really quick, easy shop floor measurements with accuracy on the parts. You, you, that's what I'm going to ask you. How, yeah. how accurate is the data that's coming out of that then, that, uh, that size? So typically on a shop floor environment, this will have an accuracy of five microns on a standard stage, which is something that other competitors really struggle to get an accurate in a shop floor environment. What, what do you do once we've got this information then? Is there a way of exporting it to get it into a metrology department? Yes, exactly. So half the problem that the companies have is traceability of the parts. So what we can produce down here is a quick PDF report of the parts that so gives you a part summary, image of the part, and a summary of all the dimensions you've taken. Where, where do you see this going? Where, where, who, who's going to buy one of these, Cameron? So what I see is any kind of production environment where you have typically a series of lathe CNC turning machines with make to make, make flat pressings, any kind of those kind of 2D parts. Typically it'd be a, a company which thinks and they need to have another step into their quality process and really want to shore up and have more control over their parts. Uh, but, but previously a, a big issue you mentioned it was light with yeah. shadow graphs and yeah. stuff like that. How, how do you overcome that with this technology to ensure so, you get the perfect result? So uh, half the problem was with lighting. So you see down here our cover can actually uh, drop down onto the part, block out any kind of ambient lighting. Again, with accuracy on the machine as well, it's got multiple step gauges and temperature sensors around the part to compensate for any kind of change in temperature, which in a shop floor environment, you have varying temperatures from machinery uh, to even the temperature outside. And that's something, any kind of change in temperature can really affect the measurement on the part. I was going to mention that one about temperature control, so you've got all that as well. Yeah. Okay, what about if this here um, quite clearly isn't big enough for the part that I'm looking to measure. Do the machines get bigger or do you just have a method of, of, of you know, measuring longer parts? So it's possible to have a larger moving sliding stage to, to fit your bigger parts on. So typically they'd be measured in batches, small batches or a few parts at a time. As you can see we've measured one part but it's possible to load another part onto there as well. Incredible and this is Brand new to the UK market, isn't it? Available from Vici Vision. Can um, engineers come here and, and bring them their parts just to test it? Or is there any way of taking one of these onto site? I don't know. How, do, yeah. how does it work? Absolutely. So uh, companies are welcome to come and bring all their parts and we can have a, have a look at the machine, or the machine can be brought to them. It's simple, it can be carried by two people anywhere. And that's part of the beauty of the machine. It's a small, lightweight machine designed to fit anywhere. I don't think you've got much competition with this either, so it would be good to see how it goes over the next few months. Thank you very much, Cameron. So there we have it, a brand new product from Vici Vision.